guys it is 7 30 or 7 40 in the morning as you guys saw but i'm so tired i look tired i know but i haven't put any makeup on and i was just thinking i could vlog today because i'm off and i'm also going to be doing some shop stuff today so i can show you guys that because i do have a um, couple of orders i need to work on and a couple of stuff that i need to print and cut sorry i feel like my face is like extra fat in the morning and my lips too like I get it from my mom like her lips like puff up when she sleeps overnight and it happens to me too so I was intending to go back to bed because I usually feed Mia every 6 in the morning and then we go back to sleep like we stay awake for like 30 minutes we just feed her and then she goes back to sleep but I don't know today I didn't go back to sleep because I had a coke this morning which is not good like I never do that I never have like just coke in the morning but i was like really feeling it this morning and then now i'm just wide awake like i'm tired but i can't go back to sleep so that's the caffeine i think and coffee barely does anything for me but i'm about to get one but as i said today i really wanted to vlog because i haven't vlogged in a while and i usually vlog when i have a day off so that's today and i like I said, I have to print and cut some stuff, some stock I need to print and cut. And I've already printed and cut my May kit, which is in there. So you can't see it right now, it's turned over. If you have no idea what I'm talking about, and this is like your first video of me, I think the only people that watches my vlogs are the ones that already know me, but I make budget kits and I also like to budget, so I use my own stickers. I'm done with that, I'm also done listing all of the main stuff. So that will be released on March 18th. My May release will be on March 18th. I also wanted to make my own like sinking funds envelope today. I bought some laminating sheets and I'm gonna try Alexander Budget's method of making like laminated cash envelopes. I'm wanting to make a lot for my sinking funds because I do have a lot of sinking funds that I want to go for but I'm not gonna like stuff them all every paycheck. I'm just gonna have them there so I'm gonna try to make some myself. So I took out my little laminator that was one of one in one of those storage boxes so I was able to take that out because I haven't laminated anything in like months now. I just bought the Amazon Basics laminating sheets because I'm just trying things out and this is like the cheaper route because the I usually use the Scotch one but that one's a little bit more expensive and I'm just trying it out trying to see if I can even do it myself and kind of I have a picture in my head of what I want things to look like and if I get there you know if I need stronger laminating sheets I'll definitely purchase those and then i bought a couple of things for mia for her like last vlog i was panicking about her eating like, solids which i we have already started feeding her solids we've given her eggs avocados that's avocados pancakes and eggs easy mama no <gasps> she's gonna throw it everywhere you gotta eat it mama as well as her milk but she definitely loves solids but i bought her one of these plates to help her or just encourage her to eat because it's cute or maybe i'm just wanting something cute for her but i bought this little plate and then i can put some fruits here that's what we need to do next is fruits and like maybe some grits because i know a lot of like moms here that i have i'm friends with they were like try grits but yeah i can put that there and i also bought a couple more things from amazon for her feeding as you guys know i was panicking last time so i got a little bit crazy and bought her these these like buying all of these like emptied out our allowance because we share our allowance we get a hundred dollars every two weeks i bought her these bowls like i said it's for like and kind of food it has three tier and then there's different sizes and i got this from amazon and then i also got her little you know spoon and fork that she can she can use because she has been using the spoon that i've been using which has like a, a longer handle 
but she's struggling to put it in her mouth but she knows it goes in her mouth and that it's used to like feed her so maybe by having these it'll help her out and these are like our little hello kitty ones i've seen this on kayla buell's vlogs and she has the gray version like the simple gray version for her baby jackson so i thought i could like go cuter and use these little hello kitty pink ones and then i got her a pair of sippy cups just because i'm gonna try to start her on these just try to introduce it i'm not gonna rush her or anything if it seems like it's not gonna go well i'm just not gonna worry about it but i'll just have them on hand just in case whenever she is ready for it i think i mentioned last time that i was gonna get a wagon for her and this is the wagon so we can transfer to and from the other house because if you guys didn't know we live with our in-laws and we just live in this garage area that we turned into an apartment we've been using this but lately we haven't been using it a lot because it's been raining a lot here like almost all week now here where i live which is in georgia it's been raining a lot so i really don't want to take her out with that in the rain so we've been staying here with our purees and our milk but we did try giving her breakfast when my husband is home and I also really want to shout out Laura. She sent us some goodies for Mia because she has her own baby girl named Maya. And I'm friends with her on Instagram and we were talking and she sent me some books and some flashcards because I was telling her I was going to start Mia up with some flashcards. And so she sent us some books. So these are her favorite books to read to her baby girl. So... I haven't opened it yet because I was saving it for- oh, it is open. So I was saving this for the vlog to show you guys. But I think it's a really cute book. I still have to like collect a lot of books and I really haven't been on that so I really need to. And then here are the flashcards that she sent us that she said her baby enjoys. So these are for animals, my first animals. And then here is my first words. So thank you so so much Laura and Maya. These are so cute and I really really appreciate these. I can definitely use these every day now. Like I haven't opened it because like I said I was waiting for the vlog. These are so cute and I know this will make a lot of difference in her vocabulary in the future if I just keep doing it and just you know try to like not stress too much about like shoving it in her face but just like you know gradually showing it to her and being on a routine with these flashcards and I still have to get her her posters that I want to put on her wall like I've already decluttered her stuff I already took the box inside the house but I also want to take some of these toys away like little that little play area right there she never uses that anymore because I think she's past it like she's not as interested as she was about two months ago so that's gonna go and also, I already have a Valentine's gift for Mia from her boyfriend at daycare. My husband's best friend's sister, sister's son, if that makes sense. Yeah, my husband's best friend, the one, our roommate, he has a sister that has a baby boy that goes to the same daycare as Mia. So, you know, we're just planning their wedding already and... He gave her a Valentine's gift. This is from him. So this is like a little head towel thingy with a hood. We love these so, so much. We only have two of these, but now we have three. And my husband loves using this when he gives Mia a bath because he's been giving Mia a bath every time I'm at work at night now. So he doesn't need me anymore. And she also got this for us like a little candy and then the unicorn of course she still can't have that candy so i'm gonna eat that and i've also set up this tier three tier plastic thing from walmart it used to hold mia's clothes but now we've totally rearranged her clothes so i have my little packing supplies in this area so i have my rigid mailers i have my tissue paper and then i have my plastic cello bags and also my little labels the please don't bend and then my freebies in there and like all the other good stuff there so it's just easier for me to reach so that's just been a working routine for me i just like showing you guys things but this is our setup i feel like it's changing a lot but i'm gonna have my coffee and maybe i'll wake up a little bit more
This is what the one that I made looks like. So it does fit a dollar bill. I did use um, Alexandria's measurements except for the length because it's supposed to be three and six, like three inches this way and then six and three quarters, something like that. Basically a fraction that I didn't want to deal with. So I just made it into like a whole number. So I did like seven inches this way. And it still works and I did like not even an inch right here I don't know the measurements oh my gosh I'm terrible I'm not that like smart Asian I am horrible with math these are amazing quality but I also like I said she doesn't sell these anymore so I may have to replace them with the ones I made because these are more accessible to me and I'll probably just keep these the ones in my wallet are these these are my previous ones and these are slightly no they're the same size actually so I can just possibly replace all of my cash envelopes to these I'm gonna do that and I'm gonna keep doing this I've been on a Romina Rosa roll right now like all of her videos that I need to catch up on my whole area right here is a mess but I'm doing this before my baby wakes up and when when I feed her and when she wakes up, I will clean up and then possibly get ready for the day because I still look like trash. <laughs> so I'm gonna keep watching and keep doing my little cash envelopes. All right, guys, it's 9.42 and I am done. I made 15 so far right now and I've hole punched them as well. So I have more than enough, I think. But if I were to think about other cash or sinking fund envelopes that I want to have one day i will definitely make some more of these i think i'm addicted i think i'm gonna make 15 more and i'm also gonna put some words over here like very similar to what mitch is doing but like maybe with a pattern and i'm just gonna use my sticker paper i'm not even gonna worry if it's not vinyl or anything it's it's fine because i'm not gonna sell these they're just you know they're just personal use it's honestly very easy and therapeutic i just need to clear up this room but anyways i also corner punch these so it's not like stabbing me and the only thing i don't like about these is they catch a lot of like dirt you won't be able to see it but some of them has dirt some of them has hair pieces laminated in between them i didn't even notice my eyes were so strained with these like my eyes are so bad but i could barely see the laminated lines for me not to cut them so i used some i don't know if you could see that little black dot but i've used some sharpie as guidelines for me but since i'm not selling them like i said it doesn't matter because they look perfect to me and i'm gonna keep doing these i don't really track my expenses anymore with like different trackers per cash envelope i just track them on my budgeting notebook so yeah i'm sorry this vlog is very heavy on these cash envelopes i just have been wanting to make these and have been wanting to add more sinking funds into our budget like potential i call them potential sinking funds because they're not going to get filled every paycheck or even every month or some of them won't even get filled till like later on they're just little sinking funds that i think we're gonna have eventually that we're gonna need like philippines i really want to take my husband to the philippines and i also what else i want to have a down payment sinking fund so whenever we do move out i love these so so much oh my god these were so fun to me so if you want to make them i will link alexandria budgets video down below so you guys can do these as well all right so this is how it turned out see these are some of the categories i have already that you guys know that that little mama mia is our allowance because you know i'm mama and she's mia so that's what it is 
Uh, I think this one will work well. I just don't like how dull the pink looks, but that's okay. And I'm really comparing it to this, but it's okay. I'll live with it. Hopefully it's not too big. I feel like it is. I feel like it really is. It's like gonna cover too much. It is looking great. It's working out. And I actually love that the pink is not so, so strong. And you can definitely see the words. I need that because I am blind. So I'm gonna do the rest of the envelopes and wake my baby up. Gonna let the sun shine in the day I'm trying to make this darkness go away I'll paint with colors And I'll sing until my lungs give out I'm gonna let the sun shine in the day And I will leave my windows open So that I can hear the sound of This is how it turned out. So we have all of our potential sinking funds and also our bills that we do have cash, like the phone for my husband and rent. Those are our two bills that are always cash. And these are just fake money inside this, by the way. So I have finished it and it's amazing some of them are not perfect like you can see they're not laminated correctly but you know it's okay and now we're gonna get ready to wake a baby girl up Ooh, no one cleaned this so my husband used this yesterday so i'm gonna get ready for her to wake up it's been so gloomy guys so gloomy but it's okay i like my sunny days i can't wait for summer to come around but i will get her baby food ready so i just kind of pick one either one and she has her spoon here and then i'll get her some water and milk just in case she doesn't finish her her baby food so i'm gonna put this here Let's wake this baby girl up. I'm not gonna turn on the lights. Mia! Mia Bells! My Mia! Oh, so cute! Mia! Good morning! Why did you try to take your blankie off? I know you're not supposed to have blankets, but I always keep an eye on her with the monitor. So, just wanna let you guys know she tries to hold my hand. Hello! She always looks for my hand and holds it. I'm right here, Mama. Sorry, Mommy's hands are cold. Oh. I'm just gonna turn over just like that. Mia! Come on! I'm gonna hang out with her for a bit in the bed. And. We'll see you guys in a little bit. We are in our throne. <laughs> what you got there, Mia? What you got? You trying to drink your water? Or are you just biting it? She's just biting the nipple like always. But she's excited about this puree. And like we, like I said, we can't go outside. It's raining. So we're going to have to stick to purees today. Okay? Purees and milk. Uh-huh. She looks so big, doesn't she? What? You look such a big girl, Mia. And then I tie, I tie her hair up sometimes. Because she does have longer bangs. She has a lot of baby hair. So, I think it's cute. What? You want this? You want it? Here you go. 
Don't eat it. Nope, nope. <laughs> Use this one. You know how this works. Right? There you go. Wink. Poked her eye. It's too long, like I said, so she needs a smaller one. Oh, that's it. We're not gonna choke on this. But I got you a smaller spoon so it's easier for you, okay? So it's another day and I have not vlogged since then. Today is the 15th of February and I think that vlog was... Uh, when was it? On the 12th. So it's been a couple of days. As you guys know, I work on weekends and I rarely get a day off. And lately my supervisor told me that we won't be having like weekend day offs for a while just because she's needing another person to kind of relieve us. And I'm kind of anti getting another person because I kind of like the hours that I have right now. It gives me a solid paycheck to contribute to our budget. But like I said, she's going to grab another person. But for right now, I'm working like 30 to 32 hours per week. And that's probably not a lot for you guys. But mine is spread out. Like if I get 32 hours, that means I have to work six days for like five to seven hours. I was wanting to close this vlog because I haven't vlogged in a while, like I said, and I just, you know, feel like I just left you guys out of nowhere. I bought these men's shirt from Amazon and I bought like four of them because I've been using my husband's shirt for work, but these are really nice and you know, they're navy blue, they can not go wrong and you know, they're not flashy, so I like them. It gives me a solid like clothes to wear for work and I donated all the shirts that my husband had that I was using for work and that was like 10 of them probably more and that honestly just helped my wardrobe like just go smaller like a little bit smaller because I'm trying to I'm trying to slowly rotate my wardrobe because I've had like clothes from a while back before I was pregnant and they were honestly smaller and now I'm a bigger woman and I have more extra you know love in me because of my baby I've been trying to rotate and like get some more bigger clothes I am now a medium I used to be a small but now I'm a medium but this is a size small for men if you want I can link it down below if you want like a shirt for your work I've also been doing this thing where I print out like a wallet size sticker for my baby like every week i print out a small picture of her and i include it in my planner i've been planning the same way same style nothing's new so i like it a lot because it's functional and i think i've already told you guys that before i'm just having a cup of coffee right here while i edit this vlog and realize i haven't closed it out so i am gonna go ahead and close it out Thank you guys so so much for watching me do my sinking funds cash envelope. I will be making more. I think I'll be making like I'll finish my whole stack of laminating sheets because I don't think I'll ever laminate things anymore. Yeah, I will have a bunch of extra sinking funds cash envelopes that will last us through our whole time budgeting. Hopefully, if not, I can always make more because honestly, the Amazon basics ones are fine. Like they're 13 bucks versus the Scotch one, which is $22. It's not bad. I'll make all of them sinking fund cash envelopes 
and they fit perfectly in my wallet and in my budgeting binder or file of facts. Please subscribe down below if you're new and give this video a thumbs up. Bye! P.S. It's still raining in this town, in this state. It's been raining every day for like the past week and a half now and I'm done with it. I'm sick of the rain. I really hope the sun comes back and gives us some more warmer days. Please.